Hello guys, today I'm going to review Greenworks Lawn Detacher. Uh, Greenworks is a company who specializes in the lawn tools and they say that lawn tools are for life. Uh, basically this detacher is an electric detacher, 10 amp, 14 inch path. That means it covers the 14 inch um, area uh, while detaching. Few of the important things which uh, uh, or few of the features which I liked about this detacher is basically it has the powerful 10 amp motor and then it has maximum 14 inch wide, wide cultivating path. Uh, it has adjustable three positions which you can adjust here. Once I open this box, I'll show you how to adjust these three positions. And important thing is it has four years warranty. Now, now first and the most important question is that what is the thatcher? A thatcher or lawn scarifier is a device that removes thatch from lawns and there are different types of detachers which includes the motorized detacher and of course this one is the motorized detacher but this is a electric motorized detacher and the model of this detacher is Greenworks 2022 10 amp 14 inch corded detacher uh, and one of the important thing I, I bought this from the Amazon and um, uh, let me tell you that uh, the number of reviews for the, the, this detacher are like around uh, 1200 reviews, 1200 plus reviews and it has 4.6 stars that means uh, it is one, uh, one of the best detacher in the market and uh, with and that, that has been supported by this 4 year warranty. So let's open this detacher and see that uh, what exactly is inside the box so pretty nicely packed detacher and let's see what is inside this detacher obviously this is the handle let's keep it then manual and this is the actual detector that's it not much is there and I do see there are some handles and clippers uh, so basically these are the replacement detaching uh, clips these clips are responsible for taking the uh, thatch out from the lawn so I'll show you this uh, uh, later on and these are some anchors to this is I think for the wire and these are some uh, nut and bolts to assemble this uh, uh, detacher. So here is the detacher uh, out of the box. So I've removed uh, all the components which and accessories which came out uh, came with this uh, detacher. I don't see much uh, uh, means like many accessories in this particular detacher and I don't think it is going to take more time to assemble because as such not much is involved in the assembling of this detacher basically there are some wire retainers are there then these are cable clips uh, which will go on the uh, handles and these are some shoes and nuts uh, which will go on the detacher uh, so basically the only thing which we have to install is the handle uh, the uh, the, uh, the switch handle and the supporting handle now let me show you what exactly this detacher is going to do so these are the clips which will rotate and uh, basically they will uh, remove the uh, as this as they rotate they will remove the thatch from the lawn now uh, some of the reviews on YouTube or Amazon uh, uh, they says that uh, and this is self propelled detacher but uh, this is not self propelled detacher i just want to 
I mean, I just want to give more emphasis on that. This is not self-propelled detacher. However, the detaching action is gentle, gently propelled it forward. It is simply it's simple physics. Uh, you will like it. By the same physics, it detaches nicely in the forward direction. Um, if you drag it backward, it might dig a hole um, or dig a little bit of soil from the um, uh, your lawn. So just go straight, and it will self propel. Uh, it will give you the feeling that it is self propelling, but it is not the self propel. And as as I mentioned earlier. Mm, this detacher is a motorized detacher. This rotates and removes the uh, thatch from the um, uh, lawn. Now, what is thatch? Thatch is a built-up organic matter which can include dead grass, leaves, stems, and overcrowded grass uh, roots, uh, which later um, uh, become the house for the weed growth. So, if you remove thatch. And after that, if you aerate and reset, your lawn will be like a uh, very good lawn, healthy lawn. So basically, uh, reducing th uh, thatch levels increases the level of water, air, and nutrients, and that can get through the root zone of the grass plants. So uh, once a year, the thatching is very important. So this is the handle uh, which will go here. Uh, like this and then there are um, uh, these nuts and these are the shoes if you see there is a curved portion over here so they will go like this in the support and then uh, this screws will go inside this one so it's, it's pretty straightforward uh, just one thing I want to re uh, yeah, one thing you have to remember before attaching this support handle you have to first pass on this retainer clip which we will be using for the uh, for the wire to hook up the wire over here so the first part is remove this let this handle pass through this one then use this one this will be somewhere here there will be a shoe sitting over here like this and this nut will the screw will go in this hole there is a hole over here if you see and there is a hole on this side so this goes like this and this screw goes like this so and once this is done then comes this starter handle this will go like this using the provided this screws. so this is just the this is what required for the assembly that means as such it is not going to take more than 15 minutes to assemble this detacher. So let me complete this uh, detaching, uh, 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 this assembly, and then we'll go to the lawn to s actually see that how exactly the detaching detacher works. Here is the final assembly of the detacher. So first part is this part where the shoes supporting shoe is installed between the handle and the detacher body with the screw this is one one part of uh, one assembly second assembly is these are the uh, this is the retainer wire clip these are retainer wire clips for the existing wire which goes to the starter button over here and the second assembly is supporting handle attached to the main handle using this one so overall it took me like not more than 10 minutes to assemble this detacher and now next, next thing is basically running this 
in the uh, are running this on the lawn one thing i just want to point out that uh, when you are running this on the lawn and when you reach the age of the lawn instead of switching off the detacher just tilt it like this so that the detacher pins goes little uh, lift upwards and then turn it around and then again continue with detaching the thatch from the lawn i'll show you exactly how it works but uh, we are now done with the assembly of the uh, detacher this is how our lawn looks like before using the detacher the plan is to use the detacher and remove the built up thatch on this lawn and after that i'm planning to use the aerator uh, to aerate uh, this lawn that means basically remove the th uh, remove the plugs from the lawn and then do the overseeding but of course uh, that i'm covering in the another video you can watch the video where i'm covering lawn mowing the thatching aeration and last is reseeding so i'll try to cover the entire the thatching process in the time lapse uh, manner to show you that how how much thatch comes out from this good looking lawn the way this machine has to be uh, restart is basically hold this button and then press this handle This is how after using the detacher you won't believe so much thatch came out from the lawn which was not visible with naked eyes and it is really really impossible to get this using the uh, just the raker means of course it is possible but uh, it would have took me like another uh, couple of hours but uh, this i'm done with uh, within like 15 20 minutes and see so this is the amount of hatch we can came out from this small portion of the lawn i have not yet done with the uh, back side of the house but uh, this is really good and the amazing thing is that almost everything is uh, dead grass no green grass is coming out from this uh, and the thatcher which is a good thing so the only only thing is our uh, light rake to collect the entire thatch came out from the grass so next step is water this entire lawn and uh, use the aerator to remove the plugs soil plugs from the lawn